Hello everyone, my name is Vincent de Montalivet. I am Data for Net Zero Offer Leader at Capgemini Group. So clearly, there is a momentum. All our organizations are now committed to net zero. The states are already engaged at the UN level. There is the Paris Agreement. We need now to reduce by 45% our emission to reach carbon neutrality. And none of the organizations, or a very few, are well equipped when it comes to better track their progress in terms of net zero commitment. So basically, we have around 90% of the organization that can fully measure in an accurate way their carbon footprint emission. On the other hand, there is also around two thirds of the organization that are not fully equipped in terms of software when it comes to the collection of the environmental data, as well as the analysis of, of such environmental data on top of it. So clearly, you can't manage what you don't measure. And typically, Mastering data is critical to achieve your net zero goal. The first step is really um, to work on the data strategy for net zero. So typically you may already have a data strategy in your organization. You may also have a climate strategy um, that is already implemented. So what you need to do is to combine both your net zero strategy with your data strategy to ensure that the data visions is well embedded into this net zero strategy. So secondly, it is about the platform built, the so-called sustainability data hub. So here we will basically uh, implement the solution on, on the vendors, on the cloud, on promise, um, as well as the carbon model uh, implementation to implement as scales the insight to activate your sustainability performance across your organizations. And thirdly, it will be about this insight creation for all ESG commitments across your organization to ensure as well that you are full committed to all ESG frameworks that you are typically complying with. So typically, there is two main domains where organizations are requiring our support. So firstly, it's really to industrialize and automate their carbon corporate footprint based on the GAC protocol to measure from scope one, scope two, and scope three overall their, their emissions. Secondly, it is to tackle one sustainability performance of a specific domain into the organization. So firstly, you really need to consider sustainability data domain the same way you consider the other data domain. Sustainability is a transversal domain, just consider it as a specific data domain. Secondly, you need to ensure that the sustainability data you report on are the same as the one you are monitoring into your sustainability performance of your organization. And third one, when it comes to scope 3 emission, engage a data strategy that go beyond your internal data. Share your data with your suppliers and build a strong data ecosystem strategy.